Hi, I'm Dylan with Unique Tech Support. I'll be filling in for Ryan today. We're going to be working with creating a new model, binding your Q500 to that model, and also linking your camera up as well. Alrighty, first step is you want to power on your ST10, and we're going to delete the previous model and create a new one. So you see this message here, just tap anywhere on the screen and it goes away. You want to go to Model Select, and this message is just telling you that you're going to disconnect from the flight systems on board the Q500, which is OK. So click OK. When you get here, you want to push your finger on the model and hold it. A box pops up. You select Delete and hit OK. Next, you want to go and click New Model. Type Select is going to be Q500 4K, which is right there in the middle and then you want to input a name at the bottom. Generally we just put in Typhoon or Q500, it doesn't matter. I'll put in Typhoon. There's the... Oh boy. It's hard to read a keyboard upside down, I'm not used to it. Once you have a model selected, save. Now you want to turn the power off and restart the ST10. Okay, step two. Once you have your SD10 restarted, you want to power everything up. doesn't really matter the order that you go in, you just want to make sure they both get power to them. You'll notice that there's no more RC connecting message, and the blue light on the bottom here should be flashing. First step, grab your quadcopter and tilt it forward to about 45 degrees. You want to do this two times, and that status LED is going to go from blue to orange. And we're good to go. So. You want to go to flight settings, you select it in the bottom middle, and you have this menu here. Bind at the top gets us to the linking page. The model on the left is your Q500. You want to select that one first, and it shows us that it is now connected. So you just hit OK. Oops. And we have three different options here because there's multiple cameras powered on in the facility right now within range of this controller. So we need to look at the serial number on top, and it shows the last two digits are BCC. So if you notice, the four, third one down, is the last three digits, BCC. We'll select that one. Connection established. Okay. Then you just return to your main screen, and it's letting us know now that there is no SD card installed. However, everything should be linked up. And it is. You can now see my hand waving in front of the screen here. And our camera will tilt up and down. We're ready to roll. Alrighty, so that's how you link up and create a new model for the Q500. Please view our Facebook page and like our posts. And you can also comment on the video section on YouTube. So we can improve our videos and get you guys the answers you need.